welcome to day four of vlogmas today i am going to be running a few errands um it is the beginning of the week so i am going to head out to bj's yet again to pick up some items for um baking this is going to be part of some of my days of vlogmas um also i am going to be picking up a gingerbread house kit probably three we always do a gingerbread house um i don't want to say competition but we all we each decorate a gingerbread house so i'm picking up those to have on hand and some few extra goodies to to decorate them today's a gorgeous day here in rhode island um so we are here with my husband <laughs> <laughs> we are eating a, a love a Spanish stew, which is called Sancocho. It's beef stew. It's kind of like a beef soup, um, and it's delicious. It's got beef in it with potatoes, yuca, plantains, and carrots, and it's delicious. How is it? Spicy. Mm -hmm. And they have a homemade oh. hot sauce, and my husband says it's good. spicy, but it's good. Delicious. It was super delicious. I'm getting there. I ate all mine. Not my rice, that's too much. I'm my getting there. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. It's really good though. So that was a Sancocho Spanish beef stew. And so Coke on the rock. And Coke on the rock. <laughs> so why ginger on the rock? And they have this homemade hot sauce. It is so good, but it's so spicy. So today, me and my husband had a Lunch date at El Paisa hey, Restaurant. We got a day whipa. Hello, everybody. So today has been such a busy and hectic day. Um, I am only a few days away from my son's birthday party, which is December 22nd. Um, and with the holidays coming, his birthday being on Christmas Day, um, everything's just so hectic. I feel like I didn't get record too much today, um, and I apologize. I know everybody's been up to this far enjoying my um, my blog miss videos. Um, today was just such a hectic day. I had to go, you know, buy things for like his Christmas party at school to start baking, preparing things, and then I had to. What else did I have to do? Oh my God. I just had to make sure I had everything. He, this weekend, his school always has like this big Christmas show, and it's this Friday, Saturday, and Sunday um, here in Rhode Island in the town of Johnston. And these kids, they prepare starting, I want to say, um, starting in September for this show. It's an amazing show, so I have to make sure he has his black pants, his black shoes, make sure his dress shoes fit him, his dress pants. So I feel like I've just been like running all over town um, between yesterday and today. I But yeah, but then I finally came home and I settled down and I came home to um, a small Scentsy order that I had placed that I'm going to share with you. I did take them out of the box um, and I've been, so I did get just four for now. I, I don't know how many of you guys um, get Scentsy. Um, but I love Scentsy, and I got four of the holiday, um, four of the holiday flavors, um, and this is how I'm going to end my night, guys, because I still have to, like, make sure homework's done, and dinner's done, and it's just, it's Monday, it's back to the routine, um, but yeah, so I ordered four, um, Scentsy bars, if you're not familiar with Scentsy, um, they sell candles, um, like wax bars, I'm sorry, um, the diffusers, they sell the warmers, um, they just have so many products. If you don't have a, if you don't know of anybody that sells Scentsy, I will put in a link to my, um, friend Crystal Frazier here in Rhode Island. You can go online and you can buy from her, um, Scentsy shop and she, and you will get it directly shipped to your house through Scentsy. So the first um, the first scent that I thought I would try, I don't know, it's something about me and pine um, for around the holidays. So the first one is the iced pine, um, when, and I wanted to give you a description because there's like a regular pine and then there's iced pine. 
So the iced pine has that smell of the green fir and pine, but it kind of has like a hint of peppermint. Um, and I like it. it. It just, I don't know, I just love the smell of pine in the winter time. It just, it smells so good. And it almost kind of has like a citrusy like hint to it. So that was the first one that I decided I was going to try. So the next scent that I got was actually um, Winter Pine. And this one I probably would assume is from like last year's scent. Um, because this one was on clearance, but it was still like $4 and maybe 25 cents, I believe. Um, the other one, the Ice Pine has that like peppermint, a hint of peppermint to it. Where this one was on clearance, I can't find the description for it. Um, but again, it's called Winter Pine. Um, this one is more potent. It is like that. I just freshly cut down my own Christmas tree scent, and I really like it. Um, I thought it would go good, maybe one of them for the living room, because I really like that pine smell. And then this one. Out of all of them, I want to say it's my favorite. It's one of the new holiday scents this year. And it's called Eskimo Kiss. Struggling here. This one's really hard to get open. Oh my goodness, I'm telling you. I'm, today, I'm a hot mess today, everybody. I love this one. So this is Eskimo Kiss. It says it's a blackberry jam with caramelized brown sugar, vanilla, and amber in a softly romantic scent. It's absolutely relaxing. It smells so good. This is something that I would probably most likely put like in my bedroom or something. It's just so soothing and so relaxing. And um, when I was picking the holiday scents, I was kind of iffy on what I would order. Oh, other than the two pine that I did order. Um, but I want to say probably this one's my favorite. And it's like a baby blue color. Um, but this one, I, I love pine. But as far as the scent, it's so clean and crisp. But um, I would have to say that this one, as of right now, is one of my favorites. I do have one more. And this one is um, Christmas Cottage. Um, let me give you a description of the scent of Christmas Cottage. So Christmas Cottage, let's see. So Christmas Cottage is a cranberry scent, kind of. It's not coming up. But it's a hint of cinnamon with... Um, with cranberries it's very soft and subtle um, so I think this would be nice especially like for the kitchen um, it just kind of gives you that apple cinnamon taste um, like if you were baking that scent if you were baking an apple pie this is exactly what it smells like so I like it I'm not too crazy about it probably because my husband's not a big fan of like anything cinnamony or things like that um, but definitely I would have to say that the Eskimo Kiss is the win for this Scentsy order. Again, if you're not familiar with Scentsy, I will link down um, a link to my Scentsy consultant. And they also have, let me see if I can pull it up for you guys, my friends. But Scentsy has partnered up with Disney. And they have some amazing things and I have to order these because we know that if it's Disney it has to be in my house um, so I am gonna find that for you they have a Disney collection and they just have so so many things that I think would be great especially for the holiday season so here's the Disney collection on sense on Sensi um, here's actually to the link of my friend crystal christopherasier.sensi.us um so these are plushes that come with scent packs inside they're like 40 bucks um but you have scentsy buddies you have scentsy buddy clips that go can go on the backpacks they have like the scent circles that are obviously like air fresheners and they have characters they have Minnie mouse and friends 
Winnie the Pooh, Frozen. Um, as far as the Scentsy Wax Bars, they have the Princess line. Come on, guys. How awesome is that? So they have Ariel, Belle, Cinderella, Mulan, of course, My Gal Minnie, and Mickey. And then they have Winnie the Pooh and Finding Nemo. So these Scentsy Bars are $6.50. I'm going to see if I can just give you a quick description on what it is. So Ariel's Under the Sea. It says True Love Awaits. So give chase and follow your heart across the oceans. So it's like emerald water, crisp, crisp green apple, and blue hibiscus. So all of these would have your, your scents. And then we have Enchanted Bell. You can always bundle them together. And they have 100 Acre Wood Scentsy Bar, Cinderella's Happily Ever After. Um, your pal Mickey, I mean, is just amazing. I mean, Disney's everywhere. Here's my silly consultant, Crystal. Crystal Frazier. She's actually a star consultant. She's amazing. She calls me her Disney nut. So, yeah, so Disney is really, I mean, these are amazing. I want to say these Scentsy Buddies. They kind of have, like, those fragrant packs inside. So, they have... A Mickey Mouse, a Minnie Mouse, and Olaf, and then Olaf that comes with a Olaf here. He comes with a warm hugs brick bundle, so he comes with the um the brick the of wax. So this one is forty dollars, and it includes your um it includes a Scentsy pack already in it. Um. But you can also order more. So these are $40. So you get mini, like a mini plush. And then you would to get a Scentsy pack. So I think these are absolutely adorable. I mean, even just the, the Scentsy bars or the circles. Those are perfect for any um, stocking stuffer. I mean, they're even great if you're for any high school kids that they have a locker, stick them in their locker. I mean, they're great. So, um, that is what my day entails. So, like I said, my day wasn't so elaborate. I'm sorry. I wish I could have given you a better video, but hey, I'm just me. That what, Like I said in my intro to Vlogmas, what you see is what you get. There are days that we are going to be crazy and funny and there are days that they I'm not gonna be like that um, but that's life and I want to thank everybody for watching and thank you for encouraging me thus far to continue to record and thanks for everybody that subscribe and I look forward to these next few days doing vlogmas so have a great night and thank you for watching